welcome to another spoiler-free movie review where I don't give anything away. John dies at the end. No, that's the name of the movie. John dies at the end. at the end. What a great movie. Throwback to the 80s, directed by Don Coscarelli, the guy who gave us the Phantasm movies. He's actually working on part five. Totally stoked about that. He recently gave us Bubba Hotep. Awesome movie. Probably Bruce Campbell's greatest acting job. Yeah, it is. I mean, of course, he's a cult classic status actor from the Evil Dead movies, but I mean, when he played Elvis, it was just awesome. And I heard that he turned down part two. Bruce, from me to you, take the part. I'm sorry, you're not Daniel Day-Lewis. You're a good actor, but take the part. Anyway, moving on. John dies at the end. Speaking of uh, the Phantasm movies that I just mentioned, Angus Scrimm has a cameo in this movie. He played the Tall Man. The movie has gore, comedy, practical effects, some digital effects. The digital effects work, though, in this movie because um, it's more practical. Uh, Robert Kurtzman is actually the special makeup effects artist. He used to be with K&B, and now you have uh, Greg Nicotero, who's the end in K&B on the Walking Dead series, so Kurtzman did this. Um, really good. I don't want to say too much about the movie. It's basically they take a drug. It's called soy sauce. It's not really soy sauce, but it makes you see things, or do you see things? You go in time, backwards in time, forwards in time. Who the hell knows? This movie is weird and great in every way. I highly, highly recommend it. I give it four out of five beers. It's not perfect, but it is great. It's not everyone's cup of tea. A lot of gore in it, but I mean, it's it's good. Talk about originality. This is original. It's based on the book. There's also a sequel to the book. I forget what it's called. The spiders? Something with spiders. This book contains a lot of spiders. I don't remember. Um, uh, I'll post it here. Yeah, that's what it's called. Um, you can buy it below. Um, what else? That's it. All right, I'm Dan. So don't take my word for it. Take yours. Trust the beard. Let me know what you think. Comment below. What do you think about Bruce Campbell not doing Bubba Hotep 2? What do you think of this movie? Right down there. Did I talk fast enough for you? Okay, see you next time. Lovecraftian moments in it. Like, if you're a fan of H.P. Lovecraft, this is. It has that kind of stuff in it in a humorous type of way. It's hard to throw that out there. Very Lovecraftian. Lovecraftian. Craftian, love, H.P. You know what I'm talking about.